Alright guys, so it's October 1st, um, new build day. Um, got a lot of stuff going on. Um, and plus it's October 1st, so it's now officially crunch time. And I got a ton to do. Um, so, butcher scene. What I'm going to do with this is... Here, I'm going to actually... It was going to be a ramp. I just don't have time to do a ramp. Um, sorry guys, but that's just the cold hard truth. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to pull this panel down actually. And I'm going to cut off that bottom piece, just reinforce the bracing on either side, but just so it's a ground level walkthrough. And I'm going to move it out two feet here, because I don't need that extra space for a ramp. I'm going to move it out, and I'll have more space inside the slaughterhouse. Um, then this end scene is going to be awesome. I have a peekaboo. I didn't have time, um, sorry guys, to make an animated prop, but I'm going to use it to control the lighting in here um, with the circular saws that are popping out of the two holes. Also, really quick, the, uh, actually, I don't think I showed any of this. Um, there was a build day, I didn't film anything. Um, but this is actually kind of exciting. We got carpet in here. And then today, um, I actually just painted on there. Uh, I'm not gonna do any extra painting in here, but there's also some new bottles, details, crates, um, that we found, these awesome bottles. So, those came in, got those, and just did spray paint on here and just a little bit on this wall. Um, but just because the fogger is going to be in this scene, obviously not exactly where it's at now, but somewhere, um, probably back in that corner, blasting fog, and it's going to be so densely filled in here that you, like, A, who's going to look back in the first place, and B, especially with the fog, you're not going to notice anything. So, that's that. Um, so yeah, that's it for now, guys. Alright guys, so I got two things done. I have these frames built, um, they're going to hold shelves, like you can see at the different heights that I'll put um, slots of OSB across, and then they're also going to, um, they're also going to be the frames that hold the panels, like I'll screw them apart, four feet apart, so they'll hold the panels, and that'll be in the hallway in um, the slaughterhouse here. Then also, let me pause this. Then over here, I got this fence made. Um, I'm not going to put it in yet, um, but it's going to go from here out, so that's going to be what divides people and makes them go winding through. But I got that built, so that was a good, quick uh, build that just needed to get done, and I got it done, so that's good. Um, I think that's it for now, guys. Alright, guys, so here's where I'm going to end it for today. Um, I got a sign made for the Voodoo Shack. Um, kind of small, but it's going to be hanging like up here. I'm going to put a beam that comes out and then have it hanging by either like chain or twine or something. Um, it says voodoo now. Uh, I just did that with Sharpie. And then I'm going to have like, I'll probably just draw some something creepy on the bottom there. I'll figure that out with time, but um, cut it out of plywood. Two sheet, or actually it was the same sheet, but I just cut it in half. So there's a top piece and a bottom piece. And then just screwed together real simply on the back. Um, but I'm leaving that there for now. But it will be hanging up here. So that'll be cool. And um, so yeah. That is it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys tomorrow, hopefully.